All right. All right, all right, all right. Hello. Hello, 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 everybody. We're back at it. We're going to continue on with the Forbidden Woods, and hopefully we can get that done in the next uh, two hours. Two hours and change. Oh, wrong stone. There we are. So, Forbidden Woods. Quite a lot of shenanigans here, but... Uh, what my focus here is to get into Yusefka's clinic through the back entrance. I also might, might want to send an NPC there as well, otherwise we're going to have to fight him. I don't want to fight him. Ah! This town's finished. Oh, oh, don't step on that. Oh, yeah, I'll, sh I'll step on it just to show you. It swings back as well. You want to be careful. Guess it can also knock you into into a ravine below. <laughs> He's hacking and whacking and flapping. I was trying to run and jump, but okay. Yeah, he didn't see me. I'll keep going. Oh, one of those. Uh oh. I feel like a beginner's trap has just happened here. Okay. Got twin blood shards, so it's alright. So what I want to do, I want to get my, okay, my vitality to, I don't know, getting close, maybe blood, it's time to put points into blood tinge, because it's getting a bit expensive just to level up now. No, okay. Angry farmers here. It's okay, we got him. He went no trouble. Yeah, that is a trap though. I can't remember what's in there. I think it's just birdies. Ow! Oh yeah, you guys, you don't believe in getting stun staggered, do you? You're one of them enemies. really use my rifle spear more often or my rifle on the spear but damage output I wasn't convinced by so oh yeah I need to go up above because uh, they're annoying Town. Okay, that's the entrance. We went up above and fell down, right? Oh, wow.
What are these beast pellets though? Yeah, because I jumped across there and fell and then went down around the side. This is a different area here. Oh no, this is where we fell, isn't it? Yeah, planks of wood. Okay. Place is kind of kind of a not a labyrinth because I I, I show, associate labyrinth with being a being a concrete like maze or something or indoor structure, but we have got this some some sort of labyrinthian sort of set up with the uh, place. Get sick of these oil lamps getting hit on there. Okay, you need to go off. Because uh, oil lantern and lan uh, uh, oil urns, I guess you call them oil, like throwing oil at us and people are working around with, with torches. I, 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 you see what's going to happen from a mile away. And I don't want no part of that, I'm afraid. I want to keep my distance from fire and oil. It's a bad mix. Go back through there, but I think we'll go up here. Items, dogs. I'll have to pick up a tonsil stone. Go to the nightmare frontier. I think it is. Round to the right of the great cathedral and seek an ancient shrouded church. The gift of the Godhead will grant you strength. Yes, I'm unquestionably certain. Tonsil stone. Alright. So, I guess, uh, by the way, uh, this guy, uh, this, this uh, interaction actually happens at any door you, you go up to, or any NPC, like, you know, even in the, in the main town. Uh, after the uh, night has progressed, Uh, you go up to any door and uh, you'll get that tonsil stone off somebody. But I think it's like because most people associate it, come through here, like afterwards, it's like. But we've just unlocked another optional area. White healing church set, though, at least. Not what this guy's doing here. Hey, Ben. What do you mean, we? I, st I You mean you spent six hours running around not knowing what to do? What's so I sat there and watched? 
<laughs> Beast Raw. <laughs> this is wee business. How you doing? How you doing, Ben? Feeling better? Feeling older? Yuck, yuck. All right, uh... Oh, wow. <laughs> this guy's spamming his grenades. Fuck you, off you go. I had to, like... Screen share it didn't at one point. Like I'd say, I thought let's just watch watch my screen. I'll show you where to go. Because like the thing is, like you have to like you have to get insight first in order to do co-op, which involves fa facing a bare minimum facing the first boss. But not you know you don't necessarily have to defeat it, but you just need to meet it. But if you uh, and obviously you need insight to to actually summon somebody, so. Be kind of rough. Oh yeah, this entire place, all the water here is oily as hell. Your back is gone? What the fuck, how's your back gone? You get up too fast, you sneeze too hard. What's going on here? Final Fantasy X, ah. Got up to the uh, bit with the fields. That's kind of kind of done. Because I kind of felt like I was forced to farm in order to get to the next area. And then there was like enemies that just would just lock you, lock you down in a in in an infinite death loop, I guess, or whatever. We got I guess an infinite death loop. You know, like when you. Uh, Oh, this is like one enemy to like put on a certain status effect, and then that's it. It's done. You're dead. You can't. You just gotta sit there and wait for like wait for like twenty turns of getting killed. Kind of what I was uh, experiencing with Final Fantasy. Like, uh, yeah, have a lot of games. You know, turn-based games where if you if if the enemy has a really good status to put on you, and you can't get an antidote off or. Or whatever, like you just uh, you just get permanent, you just get locked in. Feels rough. What's the door? Actually, I think there's an item down there. Oh, slow poison, arcane gemstone. Oh god, leeches! We do what we do want to be here. As awful as it looks. Oh wow, that second one woke up.
Yeah, that's the thing. If you don't know and it's your first time, it's, it feels like a mandatory loss. Like, And not only that, if you're going to lose, like, why should it take about 20 turns to lose? Like, if I have to struggle for, and use up all my items before I figure out, like... Okay, dirty blood. I think that's for uh, poison damage. All these little leeches inside the uh, water don't, aren't too fun. A lot of corpses washed up on the shore here. I don't really want to fight them giants, so I'm not going to. Where we want to be anyway. So I'm almost half tempted to say I like I would rather have a boss that would like kill me instantly at like I'd rather lose quickly than lose slowly. Like I don't want I hate that the thing that bothers me is the waste of time. Like, uh, the first, like, I tried, I attempted Metal Gear Solid 1, like, years ago. You know, I did play it as a kid, so I thought I'd check it out. And, uh, I think it was, like, one of the fights with Cyborg Ninja. I just ended up quitting there because it was, like, I spent about 20 minutes fighting him for him to just get all of his health, shoot, health back and then one-shot me. And it took me about 20 minutes to do that, and I was like, well, no. <laughs> I was like... Not a fan of having having to play a game. It's like those those old games. You need to like know what the hell's coming. You can't. I'd rather react on the fly than have to like find out after. I don't know. Banging my head against the wall. Uh, these like ass pulls of uh, of of attacks that enemies can do. Pretty shit. Psychomantis. I've seen uh, I've seen clips of that. It's a shame though, because I actually really want to get into Metal Gear Solid, but uh But uh I find it hard to enjoy, you know. Safka's clinic. All right, I'm back in here. Outlast. Oh, that's really good. Kanehurst summons. Now we're talking. What we want. Oh wow. Can pick up any more items in this area because uh, there's a there's a thing I want to do here before we move on. Okay. 
but uh, we will deal with her later because uh, I want to get one of the uh, things for her. Okay, what's in here? Communion! Did that do again? I think I've already got one, haven't I? Oh, more blood vials. Yeah. Yeah. What's that crackhead smurf? Oh, he's uh, it's an alien. Actually, the uh, the original owner of this place was tr was tra was uh, was transformed into that. Said, a lot of HP Lovecraftian stuff, such so like fish people, aliens, and all sorts of random beastly stuff. Uh, go to the Hunter's Dream. Now that we've got the Canehurst summons, we can uh, make our way back there. You should do. You 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 had you had, a, you had a good audience. You had a lot of people watching you. You should totally uh stream more, and raid me only me so I can have your views. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Welcome home, I'm joking, of course. Father. But no, you definitely you did well at it. You were making a little bit of money off it, weren't you? Uh, Blood Tinge. Okay, let's start leveling up Blood Tinge. We're about to get the weapons that we want for that. Farewell, good and, uh, is it this one? Which is a board? Uh, which one would be quicker? I think which is a board. I don't know if it's safer, but it'll be quicker at least. I mean, I don't really promote myself that often, honestly. Like, uh, I'll, every so often I'll, like, tweet or share on Facebook if I'm brave enough. I, I mean, I usually keep my Facebook clean of that stuff, but, uh, I guess recently I've uh, posted on there. Uh, Twitter, eh. Might post on someone else's Discord, but again, very rarely. I don't know shit about networking. Not so much for using the rifle part of this spear. God, the delay on this bloody gun. I thought it was going to be a bit better. But it's uh, clearly not how it that was advertised. It's a gun with a, sp it's a spear with a gun on it. But it shoots a full second after you press the button, so it, is it really worth using? I don't think so. Unless you went back to doing the uh, raid train stuff, which, uh, honestly, uh, I think it's pretty shit. Pretty sh I think it's kind of shit. Also, uh, wa like, you know, look at Waz dudes, like, they, they pretty much had that shit. Perfect, you know, they were They only had to do the they, they were at the end of it and didn't have to read to nobody They could have like a three-hour stream of like 20 to 30 viewers Okay, this god is fuck this rifle spear is so shit like, It's good damage like it's good But like 
not being able to uh, hit anything. Oh, like the, the the delay just makes the parry timing just so ugh, awkward. I managed to get some up there. I want to kill these guys, so I made sure. I was safe when I did this. Oh, I don't even need to activate it. I just need to walk up to it. Huh. Yeah. I mean, there's a lot of people from that side that don't don't tr don't even stream anymore because they went back to doing their normal jobs. Nortina used to do it for a bit. Also, just people, the attitude of people from those raid trains were just so toxic. The only one I uh, really interact with properly now is uh, it's 13. He's still cool and he grew past it. Or you look at other. I guess I've tried watching Minister, but. I don't really, I don't enjoy Fortnite, so. I mean, it's a good shortcut to Ophelia, but after that, like, what, what the fuck are you gonna do? <laughs> So it feels like you're working for somebody. You take a hobby and you're doing something for somebody else. And I'd rather I'd rather stream and raid over to games of a similar nature or people that I follow rather than, you know, hey, I'm playing my own game and then we're gonna go to a yet another Fortnite stream or yet another COD stream. Give a shit. I wonder what ever happened to Nos Dwarf. He seemed all right, but. Uh... I saw him. He was going proper, getting proper depressed. So you know, maybe he's not even with us. Who knows? Alright, so getting past the enemies outside of this castle is going to be a bit of work. I don't really care, but I don't think there's really going to be mu I don't think there's much benefit to being a partner, honestly. Obviously, I obviously made more, more money, but like... No, the horse is dead! But, uh... I mean, I'm... I'd be happy with just, you know, 50, like an average 50 with like 5 to 10 bit of uh, uh, chatters. Just nice and relaxed, you know what I mean? No, it's very, an oddly specific thing, but. Because I like, I've seen like some of the, some of the streams where it's like. Like 11,000 people watching and I'd just be like, I would not know how to entertain 11,000 people. And you see, like, the chat, and it's just so fast. Even in slow mode, it's it's fast. It's like, whoa. And I don't know, I fail to understand how, how, how chatters can interact with each other. It, it's just, it's just a, just a barrage of emotes. There isn't even any communication happening in, the, in there. Oh god, the wor- oh my god, the worms! The worms are tanky. So what's gonna happen when I go up here and try and fight the uh, the weird blood blood star beast looking things? I don't even know what I can't remember what their names are. The blood letters.
good old chat. Well, I mean, have you seen it? Like, just click. You just click on the most popular streamers, and they've got way too much chat for anyone to make sense of anything. Numbing mist. Oh wow. Guys are a bit rough. Rough to fight. Warm blood gemstone. Wait, that's uh, that's for uh, for the thing. Yeah, nice. Okay, poison effects. Attack up nine point one. I can. Eh, meh. J moves. Wait, uh, J. <laughs> I didn't know Jason Muse actually had this stream. What? No Limmy? I don't want to go out there. Better be safe and oh god, there's, a, there's just little groups of them. I like that. They have a the door automatic, so you can't even abuse iframes to go in there. Anyway, that's what I want. The right to Palash. <laughs> oh, fucking ghost! They all have like cut throats as well. If you see that on the see the details, they have like cut on their throat there. Oh damn! I think uh, I, I watch Excalibur's every so often, but that's because he's been he was somebody I watched back in the in the early t like. Late 2000s uh, YouTube COD days. And he did play a lot of Mass Effect 3 multiplayer back in 2012. But, you know, occasionally watch his streams, but like I said, very occasionally. I'm just gonna keep my distance. I'm just gonna cheese the hell out of this. I'm just gonna scum it up here. But his chat isn't isn't super fast either. He's like a, a free, he's like an average of 300. So it's not like the uh, you know the thousands of people. I guess it depends on what game he plays, but.
don't know, I don't like getting damaged whilst by a dead enemy there, but whatever. Oh god, there's fucking lots of them. This might be the most, the shittest gameplay you'll ever see in Bloodborne. Just keeping my distance and exploiting spear, heavy spear attacks. Not so much for that, I wanted to land a uh, cheeky little backstab on it. Yeah, enjoy the climb back up. Eh, uh, blood chunks, but we need uh, we need some. We need a couple more to level up our stuff. See what I have. Kind of a. Uh... Move set we got here. Rapier. Slash him. Ah, right, so... Oh, it becomes a slash weapon if we, uh... Okay, I see what it means. So we can still, like, it's like the threaded cane, where we can still, no matter whether it's in art mode or, uh... Or not, we can still use use the, the first, the secondary gun. Or our sidearm, so... Thinking like you can go like go like a gun only build where we just like shoot with what just shoot 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 shoot. Definitely get a bit. Get oh god English. Definitely get behind that. Obviously, we're kind of like under level for this area because it's we are getting like chunks from 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 like the floor. These ladies aren't even dropping any any items either, which is annoying. But you know what, I found a safe way to get past these girls, so... That's a chest. Okay, what we got here? Noble dress! Yeah, maybe later. You see that? Uh... What is it? Where is he? I hear him. Can't see him. Guess the good thing about that rifle, that rapier that shoots stuff, is uh, the gun is a lot faster than the uh, than the uh, one on on the rifle. Beer, so. I've never seen that attack before. Alright. 
There's a gargoyle here. You can also drop twin shards and on a rare occasion chunks, so we definitely, like I said, definitely need to look into fighting these for... Oh, wow. That's a bite. Oh, no. Please, one bite. One bite. One bite. One bite. No, please, please. No more. No more. Get off. Not about getting damn near one-shotted by, by single grab animation. He just used uh, a sonic... Like fucking screech at me. I'm trying to lower my defenses. These guys there, they have a they have a rapier. Not the same as the one I have, because it doesn't have any firing mechanism mechanism stuck to it, but No uh, yeah, no means no. Some people like the struggle. I'm not one of them people. This, I mean, this looks like a trap, right? Oh, right. They're right in front of me. I'm fucking blind. I don't know if I can fight two of them at once. Struggle snuggle. <laughs> you can get two heavy attacks on him. There we go. Oh, when they. I guess if I'm tight, if I get lucky, I can knock them on their back and that will leave them vulnerable for, for some slapping around. Executioner Gab. <coughs> ah, sorry about that. I think we can get the Evelyn in this room. Barbud register. Alright, this is the shortcut back to the beginning because we haven't actually gotten any, like, bonfire or anything. Or lantern. Yeah, back at the start, that's good. Don't want to die and have to go through the entire castle again. be a tad inconvenient. Oh no, we need to land on the table. There we go. Because we can't, we can't walk over the table, we can't climb over the table. But Evelyn, yes. That'll be our gun. There's some of a blow dart shooting at us. Oh, this is a dead end. There's some, I can't remember if there's more items down there.
Fucking hell. These old men can fence. Fuck me. Okay, there's like something shooting me and not missing at all. Okay, I can't... I don't understand. What the hell is getting me from range? Him over there? Oh, I got shot from behind, though. Can't be him from, from below, because I just, I just can't fathom the angle. Blood chunks from here. Good. There's a the boss of this area though. Uh, it's like stood in front of the uh, weapon. The weapon I actually want, like the the end game weapon. But like, I don't know if I can even get it. I don't even know if I even can get to even beat him. Because he is like hard, and we're like we're having trouble against the basic enemies of this area. So, oh god, there's two of them. Oh, wow. Oh, what the hell? The table's right up against the wall. Can I get round it? I don't care if you need a walking stick to walk. You've got one of. Look at this guy. He's got. Where does he have room for a blowtorch? A blow, blow, blow dart pipe. Like he's got a candle in one hand and a cane in the other. This is why it's called Canehurst Castle. Guys killing you with canes and putting you in a hearst. Like, I don't know. Maybe I'm just reading too into it. Is that? I I okay. I attack you, but I get killed. Okay. Quite a leap in fucking logic there. Oh god, here we go. The part where I get killed. So the ones without any heads do the scream, and the ones with heads do the uh, do the little stabby stabby. Execution of gloves. That's a really good weapon, by the way, if you're playing an arcane build. I'm just getting the hell out of there. Oh my god. Up on the roof. Like, uh. Robson and Jerome, I guess. Yeah, I think that's. I think that drop is, is lethal, so we've got to go through the window. Oh no, you don't. Oh, we were in there earlier, but I don't think I spent enough time looking for items. Hell with it. Too much shit here.
Warm blood gemstone. Okay, that's a droplet, isn't it? So we can use that in anything. Blood tinge scaling. Ooh, yeah, that's sound of that. Be very basic for what we got, but we'll take it. Is there anything out here? Can't remember. Keep running. Probably end up getting like something dropping on us with a blind running. Oh, that's a that's a finger mob. Lizard. Oh, scurrying beast. Yeah, more chunks. I feel kind of bad though using those chunks onto a weapon that I'll probably replace. One behind us. Oh, three. Okay. I'd rather not. Yeah, this ain't some trick. This is where you're supposed to go. Like, <laughs> actually, this is where the boss is, isn't it? Up top of the ladder. Yeah. Hmm. I'm not gonna lie. I I am not prepared for this. So we're gonna go back to the uh, hunter's dream. Can I use fire paper on, on this rapier? I guess I can. I don't know if it'll affect my attacks though. Alright, let's hunt the skew. Upgrade our weapons. Okay, so... Me a death. I mean, does the blood tinge scale might be a good idea?
Blood sack. Blood scaling. Huh? S. There we go. Get with that. Blood Echoes, and well, only, we can only level up twice, no good. Farewell. Do you have the Knight's Garb here? Oh boy. <laughs> All right. Uh fence. Like it's like, what? 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 They don't even give us any options to, on how to sort stuff. Whatever. Uh. Sell that noble's dress, I think. Definitely sell the hunter's axe. We're kind of done with that, aren't we? And the hunter's pistol. Thought the noble dress would have yielded a bit more. Blood echoes, but whatever. That's for uh, that's for the uh, what do you call it? Frenzies. Sell gas coins full armor. Such long gloves, don't need that. Uh, okay, I think we can level up one more time. I think. Welcome. Very well, Ned. Taken Castle.
don't know how it's going to turn out. I want to say it's going to be absolutely fucking horrible, but whatever. Why do I have the mark on me? What happened to wait? Am I am I running low low on bullets? Because uh, I've got twenty two instead of twenty. Oh, I guess that's maybe because I tested it tested out the thing. Maybe I don't know. Tested out my uh, Evelyn, but it actually shoots as fast as the Hunter pistol. I didn't know that because I never had enough blood tinge to even wield it, so I didn't know how it was effectively. All right, let's see what we have here. Probably gonna be the bit of an absolute fucking nightmare. Oh wait, the boss fight is actually after this area. It's in here. It's really quite a walk of shame to get there as well. Oh, wow. Oh wow, that hurt. Every attack he does is pretty much fucking us up here. God damn. I don't know. I, you know what? He's one of the stupidest bosses in the game. I, and I mean, I say that a lot, but like, he legitimately is. He can just spam spells at you and you can't even get fucking close without taking like a monstrous amount of damage.
I don't think I even I don't even know if there was even an opportunity to parry him there, so I don't know if there's much use in doing that. Not what I wanted to press, but whatever. Give this a go, see if it works with uh, not getting blow darted on the stairs. Or ladder there. Bloody knows exactly where to fucking shoot, even though I'm invisible, so... Oh cool, he's actually alive with no visible health. Good for him. So much for using that. Th what a waste of fucking time. I don't... Like, you gotta, you gotta love the whole uh, idea of using items to... to like, like, stealth items that don't actually provide stealth. Yeah, okay. So, five pa paper and beast blood, I guess. Beast blood pellets. Give them a go. I hate the fact that you take, there's like, you take a bit of damage before you even go into the fight, so it's like, already kind of eh. Okay, yeah, that's a that's a roll, not a fucking. Yeah, it's just spam, spam boss. Boss that can attack that fast shouldn't do that much damage. Like, it's definitely a hey comeback when you've got 50 vitality. Wow, come on. Okay. Like, seriously, I can't even get fucking close to him. How can I fight something that's. What the fuck? That wasn't even remotely close! I've been closer to the explosion in previous attacks and still and not got hit, so how the fuck does that make any sense? Like he's attacking while stun locked as well, to even add, add, add in, insult to injury. It takes like two blood vials to heal the damage that he gives you. Like, and he just casually just does that attack because, you know. I've, I've barely done any fucking damage to him. Ah, that doesn't even. But it's not even. I would have expected it to do a bit more than that, to be honest. And now he's attacking me with his actual weapons, but.
Wow. <laughs> Becomes unparryable just magically there. What's fucking terrible? Like, I fa- So, like, the melee part is, is, isn't too bad because you can at least parry him, but the fucking bit where he's just doing all the spells, it's just a nuke. He just fires nukes off in any direct- in all directions and just- You're not even- you're supposed to close the distance and- and-, and Beat him, I guess, but clearly this game is uh acted a bit fucked. I'm supposed to like how am I supposed to get up there? Like you know, like you have to go through a load of enemies and take damage for it to even fight him. Like, come on. I know he's supposed to be like some sort of hidden boss or harder boss, but like that. Just let me start the fight again, you know? Don't make me walk through a load of shit to get to him. Yeah. Get away! That's the weapon art form. It does feel a bit faster than the rapier, but the less chance of missing, I guess. I think his damage is arcane as well. I don't know how uh, how effective this setup will be. That take a little bit of damage just from from what that is. I mean, it could be blood. It could be blood blood damage as well. But it, it looks like arcane, even though it's red. This here. Oh yeah, I guess that's a hint. Like, oh god, this this boss is fucking me up. Get the hell out of here. Wow! I was damn I was damn close to just launching my controller into the fucking floor there. Like seriously, like I literally just I I think I think I took more damage. My defense made made no difference. What kind of fucking attacks does 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 he do? Life attack, that's not what I...
Okay, spells deal arcane damage. So I got it right, it does do arcane damage. But I think I'm at the maximum amount of arcane damage I can put I can give myself. Well, I guess 70. Not gonna make a world of difference though, is it? Shoot the hell out of him for the first half, maybe. I don't know. I'm not exactly spoiled on bone marrow ash. more attempt and then I'll just move on with uh, Forbidden Woods because clearly uh, I'm not supposed to fight this guy with only 21 vitality. Clearly mistakes are inevitable if he's got a spammy massive AoE. Fuck. Well, that did ha less damage by much. Definitely less. Wow, that's so bullshit. That's so bullshit. Like, it literally, you get hit by the first one and that's it. You're fucking dead. You can't even, like, correct... Like, seriously, you make one fucking mistake. Like, why, why the fuck does that... Like... It's like, oh, your controls. Might as well just fucking disconnect the controller on, on, on the attack at that point, eh? There's no point having a fucking controller plugged in. Or... Oh, hooked up right there's no point because like if you get attacked you basically just lose the ability to do anything like no dodge no fucking anything just just stand there and take it honestly i don't you know what i wouldn't be so mad at this if i didn't have to do this stupid walk of fucking shame all the way back Run out 
our bone marrow ash, which again didn't really do much for us. We're not doing that much di extra damage with the gun. I want that Chicago really badly. I mean, I can't even use it because it's it's like has the it, it costs like fifty thousand to even buy it. But being able to have access to it would be nice. That got me! What the fuck? Fucking dodge! <laughs> Do fucking anything! Seriously! Like fucking what the fuck? Wasn't even allowed to fucking move! So fucking retarded! Like, seriously, I fucking just... Like, he attacks the floor and then a fucking spike comes out of the ground? Is that fucking necessary to get t hit twice with one swing? He does enough fucking damage! We don't need two attacks on one swing! There really is no fucking need! What the fuck is that? There's really no need, like, just... What oh, beast hood at? 2.99 well, Because I got inside of the wazoo, right? I don't think having extra bullets is even helpful. <sighs> like I said, you take damage, you like ob obligatory damage. Obligatory damage just from that fucking drop. Like, it's not even that far of a drop, for fuck's sake. Like, every little bit of health. Is important.
fuck? See the fucking spam of that? Like, seriously, I'm supposed to fucking recover from that? There's a mechanic in this game where if you take damage and attack, and then attack quick enough, you'll get your health back. Oh wow. Oh fuck. Yeah, that's a, that's a new one. Fucking million fucking swords flying everywhere. I think he still has them up as well. Wow, what the fuck? So like the second attack does more damage than the first attack? He still has, he, he had his swords up in the air for fucking hours. Like seriously, like he didn't fucking, there's no downtime. There's literally, uh, I can't, I don't understand. Just fucking jumps around and spams you to death. I mean, I'm tr I'll do the physical physical defense instead this time. Well, if I go sixty with. I like all the 110s have low bloody arcane defense as well. They'll probably one shot me with the bloody spells if, with this bloody armor set up. It does way too much damage. I can't switch items on the... Come on. Why don't you let me switch items here? Figure it senses throwing a larger amount of blood. I mean, it's weak to blood blood damage, but uh, see, my blood tinge is not that high. It needs to be. It needs me to get it up to fifty.
say I lowered my arcane defense and damn near got one shotted. In fact, I'm in one shot wit range right now. What the hell? Did he have an explosive? Fuck me! Come on! Seriously, he just fucking... He, like, misses and hits. Like... It's that... I know he's supposed to be faster in that phase, but fuck me, there needs to be a limit. If I'm still recovering from the last fucking dodge, how am I supposed to dodge the second attack? I dodged the first attack successfully, but whilst I'm in... Like, I can't dodge. Like, this is as fast as I can dodge. He attacks faster than that. Swing and then swing away. And he, had, he fucking has speed and distance. Like... Fucking explain that one to me. Fucking move! Jesus! Fuck's sake! They're not allowed to make a single mistake with this boss. Even though he's got a fucking blast radius the size of a house. Every attack he does is like faster than my than any of my dodges. Did you hear that? You hear that delay? Be like, turn the camera. Instant. Dodging? Delay. You know, if I, if I saw the, you know, if, if, if the dodges were actually fucking instant. Might even, might have a chance. You know, I react, press the button, get rewarded. Nope, I have to predict everything. No fucking, do not like predictive, uh, predictive games where you have to like, predict shit. I don't think he's even weak to bolt, but we're in that kind of in the position of hey, at least it's better than nothing. I don't fucking trust this. to do heavy attack there. Oh, is he doing, oh, he's doing his fucking sword, raining sword bullshit. Which, which means it'll stagger me out of whatever attack he's going to do now. Swords are still up in the air, by the way. This is too much. Like seriously, look how long that fucking lasts for. In what fucking... Like, 
It's last. It's it's been up for like it was up for like two minutes. Like, how the fuck do you justify that? To have something that just stuns you and it prevents you from dodging and attacking. How can you fucking justify that? How is that balanced? That's not fucking challenging. That's just bullshit. Seriously, anybody who fucking defends that is a fanboy who needs to be fucking hung from a tree like a piece of shit. Seriously, like fucking fuck them. Fuck FromSoft. Fuck the person who thought that was a good idea. Fuck the people who defend it. Honestly, fucking hope they get thrown into a work camp and killed. Fucking fuck them. Useless pieces of shit. Fucking hate them. Fucking hate... I hate people who fucking enjoy this shit. Like, how can you get any fucking enjoyment out of out of this? This artificial difficulty bullshit. And you start acting like... And it's all like, oh, get good. Like, what? Yeah, okay. Okay, I thought I thought I thought I hit R1 like more than once there. So I would have expected to get more than one attack off, you know. I need to test I wanna see something like There's more damage. Okay, so that does 111. He wanted seventy eight. Do the frosting, yes, the frosting does more damage, but like it's harder to hit. Get it? I really don't get it. I mean, what happened with sleeping? I fucking I slept until midday, like from uh, whatever. Oh, just shaking with anger right now. No, I actually slept until about half. I'm <sighs> just not. I'm just not feeling it right now. I should probably just stop playing this.
Don't you love it when you hit the space bar on your fucking iPhone and it comes up with full stop instead? Do one final attempt and then uh, move on. Uh, clearly, we need, we obviously need a bigger margin for error, error aka 50 vitality, and some and a higher damaging weapon. Move, move, move. What's that? There you go. Oh, what the hell? That's like one blood vial worth of health. But you can't call that a bloody large recovery. Yeah, it looks like the, the fucking. The bloody. Okay, wait, maybe there's a trick to it. I can just destroy this. Yeah, okay, there we are. That's the trick, right? Did he actually... Did he recast it? What the fuck? It's inside the bloody wall now. Seriously, it's so spammy. I, I couldn't even parry him. He's like, buh, 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 buh. you think at least one fucking bullet would parry him there? <sighs> See, it's just like, in, in, I find a counter for the sword. It's like, and what does he mean to do? Stick it inside a wall so I can't even fucking get to it. I can't believe people actually find this fucking fun. Not allowed a single mistake there, are you? No mistakes. You need a fucking level 10 weapon. I actually feel fucking sick. I actually feel sick. This game is fucking awful. Seriously, just, just, like... I, you know, all them failed attempts, I learned fucking nothing. Except, well, that one counter, destroy the red, 
red sword to destroy the sword in the sky. But outside of that, like, I don't even know what the hell I did wrong. Like, I just dodge into an attack. I, I you know, he has... I don't even have enough fuck. I can't even heal. Like, every every attack, it's two blood vials. How? I don't even have a do level up. I know in my fucking luck, it'll probably, it'll probably scale up the damage. I don't even have any blood echoes to do the bloody rituals. I didn't even get to the unlock that shortcut. I don't want to know how many bloody. Okay, I wish you could actually just go into the menus and see how many blood vials you had. You have to go to the cell menu. I'm probably. I'm pretty sure I burnt through a shitload of blood vials just from that those failed attempts. area, don't want to get hit by a firebomb. Guess go down here. Oh, that's a different figure of a different area. Okay, I like how I looked at his body before I left and it wasn't glowing.
Guy's firing a cannon off in the distance as well. That's no, alright, perfectly fine having a parry animation not work. Oh, look at that! I actually got the parry! And I get fucking punished! <laughs> Fuck this game! Fuck this fucking game! I'm fucking done! I'm fucking done! I'm dead fucking serious! Like, seriously! Why the fuck am I- Is there a parry animation in this game? If you don't even fucking- You're supposed to interrupt the attack and it just com- It just continues? Oh yeah, I can- I'm open- I'm, He's open for a visceral attack. No fucking point if I'm flattened! Is there? No fucking point! Might as well just fucking remove him! Wait, fuck it! Fuck it, why don't I just use a wooden shield for the rest of the fucking game? How about that? Eh? Clearly this game is so fucked in the head, they don't fucking need to- Seriously, like, you're supposed to interrupt the attack, and, I, like, it's, that's the dull point. You shoot him in the middle of an attack, it stops the attack, and it opens him up for extra damage. Simple. So, when I fucking, you know, I don't understand... Be like that, see? What are you supposed to do? Notice how his attack didn't continue when I did that? That's what's supposed to happen on every fucking enemy. I don't fucking care for the... Oh, you gotta time it right. The fucking timing to even do the, do a parry is, is, is hard enough. Don't fucking put more timing within the timing. Just layering the bullshit, honestly. See? Didn't continue his attack that time, did it? Cool, I like the part where I didn't jump. Oh wow, look at that. Look at how much damage that bullet did. It's almost like we're back at Kanehurst. The game is designed to, to just be hard. Like, if you level up, it makes the enemies do more damage. And therefore, makes leveling up completely fucking pointless. See, look at that. Imagine, look at that. I parried him. The attack got interrupted and I didn't die. Just as the game is supposed to fucking do it. The whole... I, I just don't understand how, how... How you can have a mechanic that doesn't function as advertised in this game. How much does the weapon do? Eh. Probably need more blood tinge. 
Dutzend mit Damage, boah. Oh, I like how when I threw my controller across the room, it actually bounced and slid back towards me. I, think that's a, I don't even think that even scales off blood tinge, right? Uh, e scaling, really strength though, and it takes 12 quicksilver bullets to even use. Where we came in from. Uh, I can't remember if we can actually get to a uh, that top part. Oh, we can. I, I just so dark, couldn't even see. This is, this is where the NPC is. Yep, there he is. Good old lady. A child. A child! Some... Man. Whoa! Blimey, don't scare me like that. On a night like this, I took you for a monster. Oh, thank the stars, you're fairly normal. Was it you who put down that awful beast? Ooh, that thing had me trembling, froze me in my boots. And then you came along. Well, if you're a hunter, then would you know of any safe havens? Alright, so this guy is clearly a wrongdoer, so we're going to send him to you successfully clinic, because this guy is kind of like, uh, what's his name? I can't remember his name, it's from Demon Souls, he like murders the, the NPCs one by one. Uh, so, hell with that, so we're going to send him to you successfully clinic. Lovely. Thank you. It's about time I made a move. I can't very well stay out on my own. Oh, you're giving me hope. Terribly kind of you. Take this. It's all I can offer us, thanks. And then blood cocktails, if that's not a uh, hint. Thank you. I can't very well. So, yeah. Guy pillaging, like, a dead family and covered in blood and so on and so forth. Yeah. Yeah. He's, uh, he's not what he says he is. You gotta be, uh, you gotta be careful.
these guys. Head snakes. Who says all the beasts have to be mammals? And uh, this NPC there, he was added with the DLC. I think what layer is the hinter tomb? I guess the hinter tomb would be like deep. Would it be de deeper or at least the same as the central? We got the lower, which is depth three. Hinter tomb is depth two. Yeah. We've got the Ish Chalice, Loran Chalice to find. Also got the uh, Nightmare Frontier that we can look at look at as well. Welcome, what is it? Very well, man. Yeah, clearly vitality is needed here. Farewell, good man. Buy some more stuff from the inside thing. I've got seventy arcane and physical. That's like 50 50. Oh, no, 50 20. Oof. 45, 40 60. Yeah, I mean a slash slash defense in this game. Huh. I guess. Oh, we actually can. Although I could, I didn't, I didn't, I was kind of hesitant though because I wanted to uh, put the points in, to save the chunks for the uh, for the weapon I get after whatever his name is, Marta.
footage scale isn't even that high, to be honest. Still quite um still have some have more blood echoes and quicksilver bullets though. Buy some more fire paper though. And you know what I will make the hinter tomb one. The hell of it. All right, I'm fucking done. See you later. I thought I saw a man brought to life. He was warm, he came around like he was dignified. He showed me what it was to cry. Well, you couldn't be that man I adore You don't seem to know, seem to care What your heart is for No, I don't want him anymore There's nothing where we used to lie Conversation has run dry That's what's going on And nothing's fine, I'm torn I'm all out of faith This is how I feel I'm cold and I am shamed, lying naked on the floor. Illusion never changed into something real. Wide awake and I can see the perfect sky is torn. You're a little late, I'm already torn. Thank you for watching. See y'all next time. Gugger!